August 2023 marks the beginning of the final school year for Hershey, Ryder, and Wichita Falls High Schools, with Legacy and Memorial High School set to open up in 2024. And for WFISD upperclassmen, a new, innovative style of learning will be made available coming up this August. Yeah, a limited number of online courses are going to be there for juniors and seniors next school year. Josh Hoggard spoke with WFISD officials about the new course options today and has this story for us. I think it is really the way of the future. Officials with the Wichita Falls Independent School District announced an exciting new course option for juniors and seniors. A certain number of classes will be offered completely online beginning next school year. One of the main reasons is we think that online courses um, develop some skills that kids need once they get out of high school. Ward Roberts with WFISD says these online offerings for upperclassmen are just another way the district hopes to innovate and prepare their students for the next step. If you're going to go to a college or even a tech school or really get any kind of uh, education after high school, most of it will probably be done online. And that's just one of the variety of ways these courses will help meet the needs of WFISD students. Sometimes, especially as kids get into their junior and senior years, they're, they want to be in a lot of different programs and take a lot of different classes. Sometimes that's hard to schedule. So the ability to take some of these courses online would add a real a layer of flexibility for them. It's called remote asynchronous learning, and Robert says it provides an opportunity for students to build their schedules in a way that meets their needs. Asynchronous means you can do your learning whenever, whatever time fits best for you, so that they don't have to be you know, physically at school during a specific period. Um, to get their work done. Students will have to check in at least once a day, but their window in which they can choose to check in is pretty wide. It could be from 12.01 in the morning to 11.59 at night. So really, it could be just literally any time. So for the parents that may remember the nightmare that was school at home during the early months of the pandemic, don't worry, the asynchronous model isn't anything like school at home. Plus, teachers won't have the added burden of educating online and in the classroom at the same time. These teachers will have specific, dedicated, remote classes, and it'll only be remote. So they won't have to be juggling their classroom and some kids that are online. The district plans on offering a few courses online to start with. The English 3 and 4, um, we're going to try an, a math class with Algebra 2 and then government and economics and a couple of other semester electives like that. And they hope to add even more courses in the years to come. The more kids that sign up for it, the more options we can offer. Hopefully we can generate enough interest to make all those options possible. With the overall goal to better serve and educate students across Wichita Falls. It really just builds some time management skills, uh, you know, the ability to work on your own and be a self-directed learner. I think that's really important, and it'll just make their life a little bit easier to schedule. Josh Hoggard, KFDX3 News. So again, district officials say these classes will be offered based on demand. So the more students enroll in these online courses, the more availability that they're going to have in the future. For more information on these online courses and the requirements to take them, just head over to texomashomepage.com.